MTD are in Ireland today. I'm with Nick Peter from Heimbook UK. Uh, we're at ETG's headquarters here in Ireland, and I'm going to talk to Nick about um, Heimbook's work holding and the flexibility of it on a lathe here. Now, Nick, this is the first time I've seen this. I've seen a lot of your products, but this is the first time, time I've seen this in, in a demonstration, or actually in action. What have we actually got here? We've actually got a normal 65mm collet chuck, which is a mini chuck, the smallest one we do now, with an adaption on it, a jaw adaption, a jaw module, which turns that 65mm collet chuck into a fully fledged 8 inch 3 jaw chuck. So why would someone want to use this as opposed to using a normal 3 jaw? Um, it's just the interchangeability really. Everybody wants to actually get the most out of the machine they can. So either you have a collet chuck fitted to a machine so you can do your full bar capacity and then take it off and put a three jaw chuck on, or you take a three jaw chuck off and put a collet chuck on. Here we can change over from a collet chuck to a three jaw chuck in literally a minute, something like that. It is that fast. So as with this machine, this has got a 65 mil bar. Yeah. So imagine the component, I suppose, is what we're saying is bigger than that. You're going to need a three jaw solution, aren't you? Now, now, what about actually getting getting that on there? You say it takes a minute. How, how, how does it work? What's the connectivity? The connectivity is three bolts which are on the front face, which actually fasten it to an adapter on the chuck, and then a central bolt which actually moves the wings out to connect where the collet normally seats. And also on the back of that chuck is a zero point system, which actually zeroes it into the accuracy of the collet taper. So the security, the mount is very, very secure. There's no absolutely secure. Yeah, there's no way that's going anywhere at all. And then I was going to then ask you then about the the, the, the concentricity or the turning element. But what we're saying is then, if if the collet chuck's put on correctly then you're going to get your, you maintain your concentricity or your accuracy from there. That's the whole thing. You haven't got to start actually zeroing the, the chuck in because it already follows the taper of the chuck. And so all you, when you first mount the collet chuck, which stays on the machine, that's zeroed into more or less nothing. And then the collet, the, the three jaw chuck follows that. Uh, we always like to be pragmatic and look at both sides of the equation here, Nick. For, for, for me, I suppose if there is a disadvantage, it's the fact it's, it's a much longer work holding solution, isn't it? So you might lose a bit of turn in length. Yeah, there is possible. It's about 50 mil longer um, than the collet chuck itself, so it does add that to it. But with the mini chucks, we have got three different chuck lengths. So we can actually, if we want to, pick the shortest chuck length. So in the end, what happens is the collet chuck and the three jaw chuck are very, very little shorter than, uh, longer than the three jaw chuck. And this isn't obviously the only adaptation you've got, and that's the whole thing with Heimbook. It's so, so flexible. Yeah. Are we then saying that with this collet chuck, you could add, you know, you could put a mandrel onto, onto that as well, or other work holding solutions? Yeah, we've got mandrels that will fit this, which range from eight mil up to about 100 mil. Um, you've got the three jaw chuck, You've then got a um, magnet adapter, there's a Morse taper adapter, a face driver, all sorts of adaptions all go onto this and all have got the same zero point system on the back which change over within a minute or so. Uh, how popular is this in the, in the UK, around the world in fact, having being able to put this three jaw onto a collet chuck? You've got a lot of installations like this? Yeah, hundreds and hundreds of installations all around the world now to be honest. It's, it's a fairly new product, the jaw module. Um, it's superseded an older one. Uh, but it's been on the market now for a couple of years and there literally are hundreds of these around. Wow, so if you haven't seen it, there's a solution for you. If you're going between collet chucks and three jaws, if you're billet, or if you're going between billets and bar, then this could be a solution. It's quick to change over, it's accurate, it's secure, it's everything that you might need. Thank you very much, Nick. Good explanation, thanks. thanks very much, thank you.